fine, 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 fine day. Today is a present. Today is a gift. Today is a blessing. Conquer it. Conquer it all for the glory and grace of God. And to not, do not, do not, do not be afraid to face any persecution, any obstacles, any challenges that come your way. Because always remember that God's always going to be with you. Every moment of that time of suffering, in times of happiness, in times of joy, anything, any moment, any moment, any moment, any moment, God's always going to be with you. And therefore, don't be afraid to take any new opportunities in your life. And God places something in your heart to just take on in your life. Don't be afraid to pursue it. Don't ever be afraid, afraid, afraid to ever pursue it. Because always know that there's a reason and purpose why God placed that in your heart. To never forget, to never let go, and to never, ever, ever, ever forget it. And do you know what that is? That's actually following the will of God. God placed in your heart his will for you to follow. It's just a matter of you just saying you are unconditional. Yes, yeah, just tell him, okay. Let's do this. I know it's super out of my comfort zone and I know I'm so afraid what's going to happen next, but I know it is well worth it to the very end. So that's why just take it on as a challenge for yourself to just be bold, be confident, and to just embrace it all. Embrace it all and God has prepared you up to this day. He prepared you up to this day to take on anything especially the enemy, who tries to always defeat you, but you have the higher leverage. Because why? You have our blessed mother Mary, you have the power name Jesus, you have God, God, our Father, so what's there to lose? What's there to lose? Fight the good fight as a true word for Christ, not a true wimp of Christ. We're not called to be wimps. We are called to be true warriors of Christ with the boldness and with the determination and with the ambition to face anything. No matter how hard the enemy tries to silence you with his lies, endless lies, endless doubts, endless thoughts, you have the power to conquer it all. You have the power to shut the enemy up. The enemy will never conquer you. No matter how hard he tries, no matter how hard he tries through temptations, whether major or minor, doesn't matter. You have the final say. Because you will tell the enemy, no, not today, never. You can never silence me. And so that leads to the song that got selected today, which is called Speechless. And it's one of my favorite songs in the world. Because the way I personally interpret it is a message to the enemy. I cannot be silenced. You cannot keep me quiet. I'm going to proclaim the truth of Christ in this world and you cannot keep me quiet. Therefore, take that as a full message to yourself to never be afraid to speak the truth of Christ. And no matter how hard and how much persecution is upon you, Never be afraid. But take that as a challenge to prove your love for God even more. And to increase yourself in virtue. There are so many opportunities around us to grow in virtue. It's all the contrary to all the virtues. Patience and patience. And so on and so forth. So take it as a message to be bold, to be ambitious to be full of determination, to never be afraid to take on anything that God permits in your life, to take on anything that God leads you to pursue in your life and knowing with full confidence that you can fully accomplish it. All for the glory and grace of God. So with that said, and as I would love to say in all my videos, don't be afraid to be true words of Christ. Bye! Away, but to wash me away, the tide that is taking me under. Swallow what's in the for nothing to say. My voice ran down in the thunder. But I won't cry, and I won't start to grumble. Whenever they try, try to shut me.
Now that story is there